Well, we have to be a little bit cautious about this too. First of all, is there an internationally recognized right? If it ever comes to a an internet to a serious legal tribunal, any Israeli lawyer can argue and win saying there's no internationally recognized right. So you really have to be cautious about pressing this issue. The right is based on General Assembly Resolution 194. General Assembly resolutions are recommendations. They do not confer rights. Any Israeli lawyer can bring this up if it ever comes to a real debate and discussion. So first of all, be cautious. Uh, there's a moral right, but it's not a legally, a legally established right. And even Resolution 194 was qualified. But uh, the other point to recognize is that we know it will never happen. There is not going to be, it's an ugly world. It's not a pretty world, but we can't pretend that it doesn't exist. If there was, the PLO has understood this for 50 years. It's understood that the most that can be hoped for is some kind of symbolic return, family reunification, small groups, and so on. But uh, millions of, ref of Palestinians coming back to Israel will never be, will never happen. There's no international support for it. If it ever developed, Israel would use its ultimate weapons, up to nuclear weapons, to prevent it. So it's simply not going to happen. And we shouldn't dangle in front of poor people's eyes hopes that are never going to be realized. I mean, I visited refugee camps in Lebanon, Sabra Shatila camp, for example. It's, it's pitiful. It's painful. You get invited into a small room where a Palestinian family lives in a horrible slum, greeted with the usual Palestinian warm welcomes, cup of tea, and so on. And they show you the key to their home in Galilee, which they're never going to give up. What can you tell them? You can't tell them it's not going to happen, though you know it's not going to happen. Well, it, it is, in my view, immoral to dangle in front of people the hope, hopes that they know will never be realized. I don't know how to, I mean, it's just it's a terrible situation, many like it in the world. Unfortunately, it's not going to go away. <laughs>